What's up, y'all? It's your boy Rise here with Proceed with Cost of Blog. And today I'm doing my first movie review. And it's for the movie Precious. Now, I know we don't check out women movies. I'm not going to lie and so say I don't like some women movies. There are some women movies that I actually do like. But I know we don't go check out a women's movie. But everybody is talking about Monique. She deserves an Oscar. And the girl that plays Precious deserves an Oscar. So. I had to see this movie. Now, does do they deserve Oscars? Well, I'm going to save my comments for that to the end. But let me talk about the things that I do like about this movie. Number one, some great camera work in here, man. If you into the artistry of movies where you like different angles and how they shoot certain scenes where the camera is like shaking and then it's not the perfect angle, they got to move it around and stuff like that. You think like the TV show The Office where it has like that documentary type of feel. Then you're going to like the camera work in this movie, man. I only like camera work in two other movies this year. First one is Inglorious Bees and then by Clinton Tarantino and then Public Enemies. I like the camera work in that. Secondly, I like the color and the whole look and feel of the movie. Now this ain't like a Hype Williams like, you love, like, the colors in the High Williams, like, Bellio, for example, that bright colors. But, there's some pretty good colors. I like the look and feel of the movie. Great artistry. Secondly, I like the storyline, man. Some people criticize that, well, it's not realistic, you know. Oh, this can't happen to one girl. Okay, granny. But at the same time, it doesn't feel like, oh, man, this is just so ridiculous, you know. You can see something like this could happen. Nah, probably be rare, but we know, well, hopefully you know that there are a lot of people, both male and female, who have been sexy molested in sex. So, it didn't really bother me, all the stuff that was happening to it. You know, it's realistic. That's what happens in real life. The movie didn't make me feel depressed. Some people were like, oh, man, I came out the movie theater and just felt all depressed. The movie had some hope in it. You, you have to look for it, yeah, but you can tell that this young lady is going to go in a positive direction. She found some strength. You're looking in the end of the movie. I'm going to give it away. Now, for those who might be wondering, are there sexual scenes in the movie? And the answer is yes. There are, and this is spoilers, there are some scenes where they show um, pressures. Getting raped by a father. Now it doesn't. It's not like a long, drawn-out scene, but you can tell something's going on. There's no nudity, but you know it's a sexual act. But it goes away. Maybe stays like ten or fifteen, ten seconds, maybe fifteen seconds. And then she goes into this whole fantasy. And there's a lot of fantasy scenes in the movie where she likes to pretend she's somebody else because. She got all this pain. You know, a lot of people, some people, when they deal with trauma, they go into fantasy world and deny what's going on. So, there is some sexual things. Even homosexuality. One woman, one character is a lesbian and she kisses her girlfriend. Not a long, drawn out kiss, but nonetheless, she kissed her. So, there is sexuality in this. And if that bothers you, do not go see this movie at all. Alright? Finally, let's talk about Monique. Does Monique deserve an Oscar? My opinion, no. I think, and as part of it is not Monique's problem. Part of it is her character is just a little bit too one dimensional for my taste. You know, it's, you know, she sort of, not she plays herself, but I'm used to Monique being loud and cussing and rude and stuff like that. Now, not the abusive part of the course, but you're used to her being in it. You know, that's her personality. You watch the comedy special, she's just loud and... Ugh, I'm not a Monique friend, so... I'm used to her being that way, so... But, I think, at the end, you get to see more of her crazy side. Again, I'm not going to give it all away, but... You see that there's something wrong with this woman. You see it throughout the movie. Of course, you will see why you watch the movie. But 
I think at the end you get to see more dimensions to this woman. Yeah. And she her performance didn't blow me away. I think she was good for the role. I don't have no problem with her being Press's mom. Nothing wrong with it. She fits it, but she it's not an Oscar worthy performance. It reminded me of Two Face. She in Dark Knight. You remember Two Face? He was good for that role, but did he bring it above beyond? Not to me. No. But he was good. Heath Ledger. He brought it to a whole nother level. And that's when, when I say Oscar, you got to bring it to a whole nother level. Me, you thinking about, even though she didn't get nominated for Oscar, think about Latifah and set it off. She brought it to a whole nother level. Like, you didn't even, you didn't even think that was Latifah. That was like a whole nother person with this Monique. It's Monique. Me allowed to hit her. But she's a, you know, a crazy mom. Precious, a lot of times that, the woman who plays press a lot of times. So like she reading, man. It's not a blown me away performance. It's not to say that presses is not I won't say complicated, but it's not to say that she's just like a simple person. Yes, there is time when she makes you laugh, you know what I'm saying? And you get sad for her, which is good, but again it didn't capture me. It didn't just wow. I got to see another movie with this girl playing Precious. I didn't feel that way going, leaving the movie. But I felt it was a strong, good movie. And I, I can see why people read this book, you know. I won't never read it because, I, like I said, it, this is a rare thing for me to see a movie like this. But you can tell it's a good book because it's a strong storyline. So, oh, uh, I give it a B+. Plus. I don't think Monique deserves an Oscar, but if she gets an Oscar because the movie is so powerful, I wouldn't be mad. Same thing with the girl play press. I wouldn't be mad because it would be more rewarding the movie than, in my opinion, their performances, which were good, but not that next level. This is your boy Roz, Kobe Sutton, I'm out.